Electric cars. Even when car enthusiasts and customers prefer gasoline vehicles, why do you think car manufacturers are pushing EVs onto people? If you're wondering, let's dive into this video and find out why car brands are going electric. Electric vehicles were introduced in the late 1800s and were popular because they were easier to operate than gas vehicles and were also more comfortable. But, however, charging of the vehicle will often become a drawback which replaced the electric vehicles with cheaper gas-powered vehicles which can go further without fueling up. And since then, gas-powered vehicles have ruled the world until EVs came back. According to several sources, it's expected that 22% of the global vehicle sales will be electric by 2030. Now let's look at the main reasons for car manufacturers to go for electric vehicles. Number 10. Emerging versus Subsidies Since the US government is providing subsidies to consumers who buy electric vehicles, more and more people are coming forward to buy electric vehicles and are contributing towards electrification, which increases the demand for electric vehicles. So to meet the rising demand, companies are producing more EVs and also to conquer the EV market. When it's starting to hit the wave, companies started making electric counterparts for their combustion engine vehicles. Demand for EV sales has shot up from 4.3% from 2022 to 7% in 2023. Another reason for the electric car manufacturers to prefer EVs is to avoid penalties in order to meet federal vehicle emissions. Number 9. Emissions Laws The US government has implemented emissions laws and fuel economy requirements which force the EV manufacturers to push their EV sales and production to avoid costly penalties. According to the Alliance for Automotive Innovation, which represents the largest automakers operating in the US, is said to hike the fuel economy standards through 2032, which costs automakers more than $14 billion in fines based on the fuel efficiencies of the current fleets. The better fuel economy and fewer emissions of a vehicle can produce, the better will be the automaker's overall score. Besides the emission laws, cities like New York City have implemented laws which force the adoption of EVs. Doing this forces car manufacturers to increase their EV production. But car enthusiasts did not accept the transition to electric vehicles in a pleasant way. Many still prefer to go for gas-powered cars. Which type of car do you prefer, EV or gas-powered? Number 8. EV Infrastructure Shifting to electric vehicles comes with its own costs. Many startups and already established manufacturers invested a lot for the manufacturing infrastructure of EVs to meet the government's standards and laws. Automakers that invested heavily in the EV infrastructure have to push their customers into buying EVs in order to make up for their investments. Many companies get their manufacturing and production sourced from third-party manufacturers of production infrastructures, while companies like Rivian get investments from big companies like Amazon. Amazon has bought 100,000 of Rivian trucks for their deliveries and also invested in Rivian stocks. Number 7. Technology and Performance Since almost every electric car comes with the latest cutting-edge technology, Companies market their new technologies to the consumers and come up with the innovation to grab new customers. EVs are more powerful when compared to internal combustion engines when it comes to performance. The electric motors get accelerated as soon as the pedals are activated, which gives the vehicle a quick initial performance. Most accelerated vehicles are now EVs. With an EV, we provide features like LED headlights, wireless charging, sodium ion batteries, turbocharged EV engines, windows and open roofs that lighten and darken on their own depending on the sun, and 360-degree cameras and sensors which automate the driving. Companies market their technologies and performance to the customers and push their productions and sales to meet the industry standards. Did you know which is the quickest car to go from 0 to 60 miles per hour? Number 6. Cheap Maintenance Electric vehicles have fewer parts than a gas-powered vehicle, which reduces the maintenance cost of an EV. So buyers prefer EVs, which in turn makes the manufacturer increase the production to meet the ongoing needs. Rumour has it people who are buying EVs are not buying it for the environment. They simply want the electric car because they are cheaper to maintain. Electric vehicles require lesser repair costs and maintenance when compared to their gas-powered counterparts. Fewer maintenance saves time and money for EV owners. New buyers are also paying attention to lower maintenance cars that are ultimately a lot cheaper than internal combustion engine cars ICE. Let's say long-term costs are a one-off reason why consumers prefer EVs. Reports say that the average cost of maintaining a gas-powered vehicle each year is $1,117, whereas the average cost of maintaining an EV is $485. Number 5. Rising Fuel Prices Buying an electric vehicle can solve the problem of rising fuel prices. You'll no longer have to pump gas or spend money on gas if you have an EV. With an electric car, you just have to charge it in your home by plugging it into the charger overnight the same way you plug in your smartphone every day. If you're going on a longer trip, then you'll have to stop at a charging station and charge the vehicle. This way, in long term, you can save up lots of fuel costs by paying for electric instead of paying for gasoline. 
the higher gas prices gets the more EVs there will be on the road, which means the more car manufacturers have to produce. How nice would it be to no longer have to pay for gas prices? Number 4. Low Labour Costs As OEMs, original equipment manufacturers, announce more EV development and production plans, more and more EVs will be rolling out the factories. Many companies have said they'll be making only EVs at some point in the future. Government and companies are spending billions to achieve this goal. Electric vehicles need no exhaust systems, fuel injectors or starters. They do not need engine oil or transmission fluids. All these gas engines will be entirely absent from production lines, which makes the assembly process simpler. Fewer parts means lower labour cost, so companies will be able to save a lot on labour costs while production as well as during services. According to the Edison Electric Institute, there are already more than a million EVs on US roads, and there will be a projected 18 million by 2030. Number 3. Price of EVs Average price of a new EV fell by 18% over 2023 and is almost the same as gas-powered vehicles. Electric vehicles are no longer for the wealthy people. The high price tag of EV has dropped and the EV is accessible for everyone. Companies start bulk production of EVs and have built infrastructure which has reduced the price of EVs. Now, since more consumers are learning that to buy an EV you don't have to spend a fortune and are now offered an accessible price. Companies get sales when EV prices are reduced. It took 8 years to sell 1 million EVs and less than 3 years to sell the next million. Number 2. Eco-friendly The number one reason for most people to buy an EV is its impact on the environment. Electric cars produce significantly less emissions than gas-powered cars, not just while it's on the road, but also throughout the entire life cycle in the vehicle. Along with adopting EV culture, when we start using more cleaner energy sources to our grid, the carbon footprint of the electric cars will be reduced significantly. EV doesn't have tailpipe emissions, which makes EVs a powerful tool against climate change. Reports say that EVs convert over 77% of electrical energy from the grid to power at the wheels, whereas conventional gasoline vehicles only convert about 12% to 30% of the energy stored in gasoline to power at the wheels. As the effects of hydrocarbons become well known in the world, EV becomes the solution against carbon emissions. Hundreds of infants' lives will be saved and millions of children will breathe easier across the US if the nation's power grid depend on clean energy and more drivers made the switch to zero emission vehicles, according to a new report from the American Lung Association. EVs create 3,932 pounds of carbon equivalent per year, compared to 11,435 for gas-powered vehicles, according to the US Department of Energy. Number 1. Elimination of cons even though there are many reasons for the increased popularity of electric vehicles, one of the main reasons being elimination of the cons and drawbacks of owning an EV. When range anxiety hits people hard, EV companies have brought in new technology and efficient batteries to increase the driving range, so more and more people get attracted to EVs when this problem is solved. EVs now have an average of 300 plus mile range. Another one when more charging stations are popping up, more people can access the charging stations without having to wait hours to charge their vehicle. Fast charging has been introduced which makes people who complain about charging time attracted to buying EVs. When more and more problems were introduced, all those problems were resolved which gained the trust of EV customers and increased the sales, thus resulting in companies to prefer EVs more. What will be your reason to buy an EV? Let us know in the comments section. If you haven't subscribed yet, consider subscribing and giving us a thumbs up. For more videos like this, stay tuned!